We'll want to use make sure the money's in Rosemary's account by the end of the day. We need to complete on the sale of the whole farm business estate. Why can't you do it? Because I've got other things to sort out, and I've asked you to do it. You're not still on about the vets. Why would you, of all people, want to get involved in a sick animal trade? I don't. But there is always money to be made when somebody's desperate to raise cash. I thought Paddy had his finances sorted. Ah, uh, might not be as simple as he first imagined. Why? What are you planning? Not much. Just off to visit an old friend. What's this be a special to you? Like this or this? Mm, both. So what you're saying is neither of them stand out. I knew I didn't have anything to wear. You must be joking. Imelda Marcos had more space left in her wardrobes than you. But I don't have anything with enough wow factor for this shoot I'm doing tomorrow. I thought it was the client's job to provide clothing. I still need something to greet them in. Knock them dead straight away. You always knock me dead, Kel, whatever you're wearing. But if you feel that you need the best, yeah, go wild with this. You've just been mugged. You should call the police. Maybe I should give your mate Barraclough a bell. She's not my mate. Well, Kelly's mine. One day you'll realise that it makes life a lot simpler if you give women what they want straight away. Oh, I don't know. I'm starting to think it's better to make them wait. Any idea when you'll be finished writing up your final notes on the King case? Vaughan wants them for review now you're off the case. Well, why didn't he come and ask me himself? He just wants me to talk him through something. Well, I think you'll find that they're all up to date. It's not as if I've had much else to occupy me these days. Well, I'm sure it won't be long before everybody forgets about what happened. Well, they certainly seem to have in your case. Anyone would think you weren't part of what happened. Hold on. Everybody knows that I was not responsible. You were so desperate to pin it on one of the kings. You got way too involved. Us emotional women always do. From now on, I'll just leave it to the old boys' club, shall I? It's not like that, Grace. Look, you're, you're a well-respected officer. You just... I'm trying to tell you that if you want to salvage your career, then well, you need to keep your head down for a while. What do you think I'm doing? The money's to be transferred into an account under the name King. Do you want me to get that? Uh, just a nuisance call. Sorry, that's right. Rosemary King. Called the bank. The money's gone through. About time, too. It's worth every penny to get you out of our lives. Congratulations. You're a wealthy woman again. That's hard to keep me in the style I'm accustomed to forever. I've been thinking of investing. Yes, you should make your money work for you. I'll keep my eye out for a useful opportunity. Mm. What are you doing here? <laughs> what do people normally do in pubs? Wait for a copper, snoop around and freak everybody out. Well, I was simply in the area and thought it was a public bar. Yeah, well, as long as you're not planning to stir up trouble. Couldn't, even if I wanted to. I'm surprised you have the nerve to show your face around here after the travesty you made of my husband's murder investigation. You and your son might have had something to do with that, Mrs. King. I don't know what you mean. I know it was you paying off the witnesses. And if I could prove it, I would have you charged with obstructing the course of justice. You're the reason the case got thrown out of court. 
So, if you're not here in the pursuit of justice, what are you doing? Nothing. I'm leaving. Good. What are you doing? You said you were going to call me. I said I might. I didn't expect you to come looking for me. I thought you wanted to talk. We can't do it here when my brothers can find us. I was going to call to tell you I've booked us in to the Chancellor for dinner tomorrow. The Chancellor Hotel? That's not a problem, is it? Come here. You're the one who's been following me. You drove all this way because I didn't call you, and now you suddenly claim that you're getting cold feet. Well, I want to talk to you, but I, I just don't see why it has to be a hotel. It's out of the way. And the restaurant's not got a bad reputation for somewhere so remote. So we'll just be having dinner. Unless you find that you can't keep your hands off me. Oh, I think I might just be able to control myself. <laughs> so I'll see you tomorrow. I'll try my best to get there. Make sure you do.